Hello everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to create a 2D AutoCAD drawing and we will focus on explaining the technical drawing step by step. This drawing consists of several dimensions, fillets, radius, lines, etc. If you are looking to improve your AutoCAD skill, you are in the right place. So let's start. Step 1. Set up your workspace. We are going to divide this lecture in 5 steps. If you follow these 5 steps, you can make this drawing very easily. Step 1. Set up your workspace. In AutoCAD, the first step to set up your workspace with correct unit. Make sure your units are set in millimeter as a drawing in the dimension in millimeters. So you can do this by typing simply UNITS units press enter. Now you can follow this step. Types decimal precision 0, 0, 0. Then angle type decimal degrees. Then insertion scale will be millimeters then now you can press ok so your first step almost complete now step second start with the outer rectangle as you see in the drawing you can see this is just a rectangle from here to here it will be 114 by 82 millimeter so to create this use the rectangle command so you can activate rectangle command using REC otherwise you can go draw tab and now here you can find rectangle command so now we start the creating this drawing REC shortcut of rectangle press enter click first point press D for dimension enter 114 enter then now 82 enter now you see rectangle almost complete now step 3 create a drawing curves and radius now you see in the drawing you see here curves then circle now we are going to create in the middle of the drawing we have a circles specific radius the circle have the following radius for example 5 10 12 to draw this use the circle command c is the shortcut of circle command press enter now here center create a circle radius will be 10 so radius 10 select this circle move inside press f9 to activate ortho 10 distance downside l for line first point now here again line first point to just like that use trim command using tr enter now trim this line again we are going to create as same as in right side just press c for circle click here radius will be 12 select this one m for move left side 13.5 again press l for line first point to end point first point to end point now we are going to trim this one and this one if you see we have a four circle first one then second one third one and fourth one we are going to create c for circle circle radius will be 5 5 enter select this one m for move 10 unit again select m for move 10 unit if you are going to move 15 no problem now 5 again m for move p for previous selection enter now 5 so now we are going to create these circles and line in opposite side so now you are going to select this one and select this one mi for mirror command for mirror this object so just click on center and just click now we have a two option erase source object or not so i'm not going to erase the main object main object this one so yes press no then now we select this one mi for mirror and from center click just like again we are not going to erase the main object so now tr for trim trim unwanted part of your drawing almost 80 percent complete of your drawing so we have last one we are going to create these curves 10 unit 10 mm and 10 mm you can use chamfer command c h a m chamfer press enter we have a two dimension so d for dimension press value 10 again 10 so just click first line and second line if you want to create multiple chamfers c h a m f e r chamfer d for dimension already put and you can type m for multiple times chamfer first point second point now again first point second point first point and second point now you're drawing almost complete so step four adding similar segments of inner details just like dimensions radius etc after complete applying dimensions the basic shapes almost complete we need to apply the dimension as shown in the drawing dimension dim for dimension command using dim for dimension command click first point second point again first point 
second point first point second point dco for dimension continuous first point second third and fourth dli for dimension linear first point second point dco for dimension continuous now your drawing is complete if you want to add thickness so select this basic shapes go to properties go to properties now here the thickness of your line as you want you can select thickness line for from here so almost this drawing is complete i used to make my videos in hindi but viewers from all over the world follow our youtube channel many of you often come in asking me to make videos in english so i tried to create this video in english please give me your feedback and tell me how would you like my videos in english thank you thanks for your time i request you to all subscribe our youtube channel like comment and share thank you